What's going on, Studio Goers? Dr. Freeman here, and welcome to episode 5 of Tips to Survive the Daisy Standalone. We have a couple things that we're going to be going over today, including how to use a map properly, looting some cars, as well as a uh, neat little trick that you can use if you have come across a first aid kit. But uh, we're going to start right off with uh, map use and get right into it. Now, uh, every once in a while, you know, you'll come across a map of what is uh, Chinaris and it is either going to be you know a southwestern map a northern map something like that it's just going to uh, focus on you know one area of Chinaris no longer do we have the uh, all-encompassing uh, map that we used to have at least not that I have seen or heard of maybe there'll be uh, one drop down or maybe there, it is out there and it's just really rare but um, we, we do have uh, maps here and the way you want to use it is what you got to do is when you have it in your inventory you actually have to attach it to your belt um, and you can see here, I think I put it on the number three. And once you're uh, running around doing what you got to do, if you want to use it, you just tap your number three button and it will pop up. And then you can, you know, zoom out, zoom in, things like that. What I do want to uh, mention is in, in the mod, you could uh, drop waypoints. So even if you didn't have a GPS or something like that, it was really easy to find your way around. You just drop the waypoint on the town you want to go to. And sure enough, you could uh, follow that. You can't do that here, so uh, and there is no GPS, so you have to follow more traditional routes, um, things like you know checking signs um, it, within the town and actually uh, referencing that off the map. So <clears throat> be uh, be wary of that. Next thing I want to talk about is looting cars. A lot of people don't do this, or maybe they didn't even know about doing this. But uh, make sure as you're going through a town, you see these uh, busted down cars, you know, on the side of the road and parking lots, things like that. It doesn't take long, and these are really, really good uh, loot spawns because typically you will find things like uh, melee weapons such as pipe wrenches, axes, bats, crowbars. Um, th these are all all good things, and you can find them whether it's in the trunk in, the, in uh, either of the doors as well as uh, a lot of times I've found weapons actually on the hood of the cars so make sure you roll by these uh, by these vehicles it, it takes you know a quarter of the time it does to actually loot a house so uh, check them out I've also found maps food batteries um, other utility items and uh, things like that so don't forget to check the cars the last thing I want to get into guys is a first aid kit every once in a while whether you're uh, uh, I've seen them both in fire stations as well as the hospitals, and that's the first aid kit. And uh, when you run across one of these, especially if it's full, um, you'll open it up and you'll see that there's, it, it shows it right there, that there's six items typically in the first aid kit, and you can drag each one of those items individually over to your player. Well, that takes up six slots, right? But if you just drag the first aid kit over, that takes up only four slots. So instead of individually saying, like, all right, you know, I want some rags or I want um, you know or I mean the bandage or the the syringe or whatever it might be just take the whole first aid kit drop it over into your uh, into your player that way it's only taking up four slots and if you happen to need something just you know go into your inventory slide it over to the left hand side so it opens it up take out what you need use it and put the first aid kit back into your inventory and that gives you a, a couple extra slots to use all right, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. I really hope you enjoyed. And remember, as always, to like if you did, favorite if you happen to learn something, and subscribe for more. Otherwise, I'm going to be talking to you guys later. Peace.